This is a... This is... This is a big mountain, huh? A lot of... Oh, a lot of steps. Oh, Grump, I knew this was a bad idea. Oh, no, I'm fine, really. Oh, hey. You look just like my friend Agabel. Agabel! Oh, it's really you! Oh, you're here, alive, and not dead! Yes, it's me, Philbo. Calm down, you'll hyperventilate. Huh? Oh, okay, okay, uh, yeah. Um, oh, are you coming back to Snacksburg? Come on, get up. Let's get this door open before altitude sickness kicks in. Oh, Agabel, it's so good. I can't believe you've been up here all this time. You're so, uh, different. That's right. The soft little Agabel you knew is gone. Yeah, you really came out of your shell, huh? <laughs> hey, um, so why do you want my help? I thought you would have asked Chandlo. Chandlo's got Snorpy to worry about. Besides, you've been following Liz around for years. What? I don't follow her around? Uh-huh. The point is, I know you care. And since I need three grumps, you might as well be one of them. Whoa, what is that thing? Liz thought it might be some kind of ancient temple to bug snacks. Oh, uh, wait a minute. If this door takes three of us to open, how would Lizbert get inside by herself? What makes you think she's behind it? Because she has to be. I looked everywhere else. Well, it, it definitely looks important. How do we, uh, get in? Right. We need to stand here, here, and here. On three, we push. This is it. Ready? One, two, three! <laughs> <laughs> Grump! I could have killed us all! What did I do wrong? Hey, hey, it's okay, Agabel. That was kind of scary, but we're fine. We'll just try it again and... No! I'll try it again! You two are going home! Agabel, I want to find Lizbert just as badly as you do. You don't have to do this alone. Yes, I do! I'm a burden to everybody around me. That's why she's gone! W what do you mean? I was being stupid, and I slipped up on the cliffs while I was trying to show off. The earthquake hit, and, and I was going to fall, but Liz saved me, like she always does. She got swept away, and then the ground opened beneath her, and it, it swallowed her up. I'm so sorry, Agabel. Don't be. I'm used to it. Please, just go. I can't stand to see anyone else hurt. <laughs> You know, when I was looking for Lizbert, I got really hungry. I, I couldn't catch bug snacks, so I tried eating this purple flower, but then I threw up. And then I went blind for a bit, and then I fell in a hole. And, and, and by the time I dragged myself out of there, I, I was so tired and hungry I could barely move. That's when we met, buddy. Philbo, th that's awful. <laughs> it was. Because, <laughs> you know... I, I can't make it on my own like you and Lizbert. And it's times like those when I could really use a doctor. <laughs> All right. I get it. I need some time to think. I still want to figure out what I got wrong. When I do, I'll come find you. And then we'll find Liz together. Thank you, Philbo. Stay safe.
Yes. I'm afraid we went after the wrong target. The mountain is now more active than ever. But the good news is I've isolated the source of this seismic activity. The bad news is it's on the frosted peak, and this time I've no idea what it might be. Be on your toes, chum. This one could get messy. <laughs> Want something? Oh, hi. You're almost there, chum. You should see some flares along the way. Though you may need help lighting them. Ha ha ha! It's the last place the Grumpanati would expect me to be. That, and I'd hate to make you do such a dangerous mission alone. Here we are, at the source of the seismic readings. But where is the cause? Hmm, it's still a little dark in here. Perhaps you should light that suspicious candle. Dragon trip! That's it! The Grumpanati's secret weapon! Quickly, Chuck, dispose of this devious dessert before it brings the mountain down on us! Worry. According to my Baby, 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 baby,
Brilliant work! The seismic activity has ceased for the moment. You know, for a secret weapon, that was a little lacking in subtlety. Who do the Grumpanati think they're fooling? I mean, honestly, what natural evolutionary process could possibly result in a birthday cake? 
heart. No matter. Feed me the cake legs and we can leave this dreadful mountain. <laughs> A happy birthday indeed. Thanks to you, we saved the island. Now let's hurry back to Snacksburg post haste. My paws are about to freeze off. Snorpy, what the grump? You climbed up the mountain? Without me? Grumping, why? I, I, I wish I could tell you. Then tell me. I'm done playing games, dog. You could have died up there. And then what would I do, huh? I'm sorry, Chandlo. That was not cool. Just, I gotta chill out. You figure out when you're ready to talk to me. I know he hates being in the dark, and I hate leaving him there. I want to tell him everything, but I don't want to lose him. Is that really it? No. No. Uh, the truth is, I don't think he'll believe me. But now it seems like I might lose him whether I tell him or not. So congratulations, Grumpy Naughty. You win. Oh, thanks for the help. Uh, Chum, I need your help with a matter of grave importance. You see, my seismic readings have been off the charts today, and I fear something terrible is happening just off the coast. Chandlo and I are headed to Simmering Springs to investigate, and I'd be greatly reassured if you could join us. Splendid! Meet us there whenever you get the chance. In the meantime, we have preparations to make. Chandlo! Ready the sunscreen! <laughs> Wimbus. Sure is a nice day, isn't it?
Mini Mac. <laughs> Have a beach party? Need me to sunscreen your back, Snorp Dog? No, no, no need, Chandler. I'm well protected. I can tolerate the horrible sun for at least a few minutes. You sure? I could check if you missed a spot. <laughs> Best to keep our wits about us. This seismic event could happen any moment. Oh, oh, oh. Bro, what was that? They're not usually this intense. An anomaly, to be sure, but it ended surprisingly quick. Oh, oh, oh. It's a new island, dog. We gotta go over there. Uh, must we? Uh, um, yes, uh, of course. Uh, but, but surely this job is bigger than the three of us. We need to form a miniature expedition. A gathering of our finest scientific minds. Of course, that means Triffany and... Floofty. Ooh, get Shelda, too! Shelda? Well, she's hardly qualified. You said you want the finest minds, and Shelda's loaded with wisdom. Bam! Team assembled! Oh, I suppose she is an herbalist, and the closest thing we have to a doctor without Eggabel around. Very well. Tell Triffany, Floofty, and Shelda to come to the beach. Chandler and I will stay here to prepare a way across. Get hyped! <laughs> 